please introduce yourself and tell us how you engage with the UK Parliament. My name is Bemi Oluleye. I'm an, an assistant professor, strict lecturer at Imperial College London. I lead a research activity and a research group looking at achieving cost effective decarbonisation of the industrial sector. My first engagement with Parliament was um, I was invited as a keynote speaker for a roundtable discussion on industrial decarbonisation and the roundtable was organised by the All Party Parliamentary Climate Change Group. Um, you know, it was run by Policy Connect and I think Imperial's um, Grantham Institute for Climate Change and the Environment was a sponsor for this event. So I spoke about, you know, the technologies relevant for industrial decarbonisation, but also on how to achieve it um, in terms of a mix of policies and business models. How did you feel about engaging with Parliament before you got involved and did that change after you engaged? I've got a multidisciplinary expertise in engineering, economics and policy, so I've always been interested in engaging with Parliament, so I guess I was just waiting for the opportunity. So when I was invited, I was excited about it, that I was going to present some form of evidence um, or talk more broadly about industrial decarbonisation. And um, so I, I accepted the invite and, and we had the discussion and it was successful. We went on to uh, publish a, a joint uh, paper with um, Lord Brown of Ladington um, on industrial decarbonisation, the cost effectiveness. So I would say it was, it was a positive experience um, for me. I, I learned a lot and I hope everyone who listens or uh, everyone who was part of that roundtable discussion also um, learned a lot. Was there any support for you to engage with Parliament, either from the parliamentary team that you engaged with or from your university? And if so, how did that help you? I, I received tremendous support from my university, Imperial College. I received support from the Grantham's Institute of Climate Change and Environment. I received support from Policy Connect, who ran the um, All Parliamentary um, Climate Change Group. Uh, specifically, the support I received from the university through the forum was a training on how to speak to to um, members of parliament you know how to present um evidence or how to present my research in a very simple way um that they can understand um, and you know avoid all the scientific jargons so that that helped me to to boost my confidence and to focus my talk um so i can achieve a lot in the time i, I was given um, also from Policy Connect, I received support when I was writing uh, the essay, co-authoring the essay with Lord Brown of Ladington on, you know, use of uh, simple languages um, to convey a very complex um, engineering phenomenon. Um, so, so this was, yeah, so this helped me um, throughout the process and, and afterwards. Would you engage with Parliament again? My answer is an absolute yes. I think it's important for researchers to engage with Parliament once in a while, especially since um, if you look at the UK, net zero carbon uh, or net zero greenhouse gas has been passed into law and the, the ambition is to achieve it by 2050. So I think researchers who are doing research in climate change directly or indirectly should seize the opportunities or embrace the opportunities to engage with parliament to let them know about the science, what the challenges are, but most importantly, how they can be overcome. Um, so if, if I'm given the opportunity again, I will absolutely say yes.